During this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can add even more scarcity to your website or your sales page using our scarcity builder with our bottom slider. All right, so let's go ahead and dive right into it. Here I am right now on a sales page and I want to add more scarcity and the urgency to my sales page. So I'm going to add a bottom slider that includes a countdown timer and a buy button for my product. So the first thing we want to do is click on the gear symbol up here. Next, you want to choose bottom slider. And upon doing so, you should see the bottom slider settings. And I'm going to click on enable. If you've never done this before, you're going to have to enable it on your sales page. So we're going to enable that. And we're going to see this bottom slider appear down here at the bottom of our page. Now we can change when this slider actually appears. We can have it appear every time the page is loaded for the very first visit only once a day, once a week, and so forth. So for right now, I'm gonna leave it every time the page is loaded. And next, you can allow the visitor to close out of your slider or not. So I'm not gonna allow them to close out of it, so I'm gonna keep that up. Next, I'm gonna hide this panel, and we now have this slider down here. Now the next thing I wanna to do to add my scarcity is I'm gonna to go to our combo elements on the left side over here, and we have order scarcity number one and order scarcity number two. So I'm gonna go with number two for the sake of this. I'm gonna drag it down there and drop it down there. And you can see that it's kind of already preloaded for us. We have a nice little call to action here with a countdown timer and our order now button. And of course we can customize the way this looks and feels to match our website completely. And we're gonna do that just like we do everything else. You're gonna click on the element that you wanna change. You're gonna click on the gear symbol here and you can change the way it looks and feels on the right hand side when the settings appear. So we can change the countdown timer here. We can change the design of this to really match our website. We can change this order now button. We can change the way the button looks, what it says. I'm gonna change it to add to cart to kind of match my call to action above there on the sales page. I want it to match. I'm gonna add, add to cart there. Maybe a little arrow or something I can put there to kind of draw attention to it. We can go back, we can change this text, we can change the color of this text, and we can also change this background bottom slider as well. If you click on the background here, you're going to see the little gear symbol appear, so we can click on that. And now we can change the margin of the padding, the background color, we can add a background image, we can add borders. So let's go in here and change this color. Maybe something red like that, you know. Let's try that out. Or maybe you want to add some kind of background image, which can be a great thing. So I'm going to go in here and go to the pre-made images that they have. Maybe we can use something like that there. Let's go with the, uh, let's try this one right here. So we're going to do that there, just like that. I'm going to keep the text just like it is. It says quick, offer expires in two days, seven hours. So we can change that text to whatever we want to really add to the urgency. And of course, you can add anything to this bottom slider. It doesn't have to be the scarcity builder, or you can add even more. It could be the scarcity builder. We can add a title, for example. Let's go back to our basic elements over here. We can drag and drop a title element down here, just like that there, or we can keep it just with the scarcity builder. We can even use this to add an opt-in form instead of a buy button. You can always have an opt-in form appear at the bottom of your website to capture the leads of your visitor. So let's go ahead and see what this looks like on our actual page. So I'm gonna save this. Then we're gonna click on the little eye symbol so we can have this load up and see what it looks like. There we go, just like that, and it pops up for us. And this now is gonna be on the bottom of our page, no matter where the visitor scrolls throughout our sales page, that's always gonna be there. They're always gonna see that countdown timer and they're always gonna see that add to cart button so they can make a decision and this really adds a lot of great urgency and scarcity to your offer. And this is one of the great elements that is included with the InstaBuilder 2.0. So be sure to check that feature out if you're looking to add scarcity and urgency to your sales pages or any other pages.